it's worth giving a bit of historical context to the original conception of the Millennium Development Goals, which as we know are the um, goals that, the eight goals that we've agreed as a global community uh, in September 2000 in New York around child mortality, maternal mortality, gender equality, environmental sustainability, and so on. And in the original conception of the Millennium Development Goals, there was an extra Millennium Development Goal, which was focused on reproductive health, contraception, family planning. And in the discussions in New York in the lead up, three uh, countries basically lobbied against the inclusion of a reproductive health Millennium Development Goal, which would have galvanized the world community around this. And it was the US, the Vatican, and Iran. <laughs> and at no other time in world history have those three countries or entities <laughs> agreed on anything. <laughs> on anything. And yet they were, and this is the elephant in the room, they were able to come together in this interfaith dialogue, so to speak, um, and agree to limit the choices of women. And so we have a giggle, and it's kind of funny that these three groups came together, but the one thing they can agree on amidst all the things in the world is to limit the choices of women and the kind of impact that's had on development practice. So there is an elephant in the room there that we need to be very concerned about.